Hawk Mountain Sanctuary was founded in 1934 by Rosalie Edge as not only the first sanctuary for birds of prey in the world, but as a sanctuary for all wildlife. Our first curator, Maurice Brune, was an avid birder, botanist, and all-around naturalist. He and his wife Irma's commitment to the preservation and sanctity of the sanctuary was astounding, but did not come without its challenges. Local hunters who historically used the mountain as a prime location for hawk shooting had a genuine distaste for the Bruins, who patrolled, maintained, and successfully protected the newfound sanctuary in the name of conservation. Today, the legacy of Rosalie Edge and the Bruins continues by upholding the mountain as sacrosanct through conservation science, education, and stewardship, and by maintaining Hawk Mountain first and foremost as a sanctuary for all wildlife. After all, in the words of our founder, the time to protect a species is while it's still coming. Nestled among the rocks and boulders within Hawk Mountain Sanctuary's rich top ecosystem is a vibrant community of lichens and mosses. Lichen are composite organisms, a symbiotic association of algae and fungi. A pioneer species, lichen can take up to a thousand years to fully develop, but can be destroyed by a single footstep. In order to protect this sensitive habitat and provide a safer, more enjoyable experience on our most challenging trail, Hawk Mountain Sanctuary's award-winning stewardship department initiated the relocation of a quarter-mile section of our famed Skyline Trail, which bisected this unique ecological feature. Guided by scientific data in conjunction with years of direct observation, the site of the relocated trail section was delineated with consideration given to visitor experience via a natural pathway as well as maintaining our healthy Appalachian ecosystem. The field portion of the Skyline Relocation Project was initiated in January 2022, utilizing full-time staff, special project stewards, and dedicated volunteers. While fieldwork in Pennsylvania winters presents unique challenges, it did aid in mitigating negative impacts to the surrounding forest. On two steeper sections of the relocated trail, log ladders were constructed in lieu of check steps in order to limit erosion and prevent gullying of the trail while providing hikers with ample stability underfoot. All lumber used during construction was harvested on site utilizing dead standing oaks. Side rails were peeled using draw knives to increase the longevity of the structure and individual treads milled in the field. With conservation in mind, all remnants were used as fill. In order to maintain an ideal observation area on this section of our ridgetop, a spur trail was created, leading to the new official East Rocks Overlook. Railings were constructed, again utilizing on-site materials in order to increase visitor safety as well as protect the sensitive wildlife communities that call our sanctuary home. To this end, subtle reminders were created and placed throughout our new Skyline Trail. As everyone has just witnessed, this project took a great deal of effort and resources. It was conducted to meet two of Hawk Mountain Sanctuary's values, conservation and safety. From the building of the new piece of trail to constructing the East Rocks Overlook, a tremendous amount of care was put into each segment, literally every step of the way. Your part, the hiking community, is to enjoy our labor of love for our sanctuary and by staying on the trail, you will help us achieve the long-term sanctuary mission and the preservation for all wildlife. The stewardship team and the entire Hawk Mountain Sanctuary family want to thank all those that support our mission in protecting raptors and their habitats. Yeah, so we're out here today on Hawk Mountain. We are blazing the new trail that had just officially opened today and it's absolutely beautiful. They're doing amazing work here. 